because we have really worked our body. So to start with, just sit on your sit bone, place your feet in front of you. Lift your arms up, engage your core, keep your back straight, keep your arms in line with your ears, stretching your fingers up, dropping your shoulders. Just hold it there. Take deep breaths into your belly. And I want to count to 16. Just hold. So this, just this act of holding this posture is working your core and working your entire body because you're engaging them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and bring your palms down. Place them next to you on the floor. Lengthen your spine by pressing your palms down and raising your spine but your shoulders should be away from your ears okay. Dandasana relax place your palms in front of you inhale as you exhale just push your chest forward don't hunch your back push your chest forward inhale come back exhale push your chest forward inhale come back Exhale, push your chest forward. Again, inhale, come back. Now, push your chest forward and put your palms on your feet. Hold your feet. Just hold this position. You don't have to do anything. Just hold it. Pull your toes towards you. Lengthen your spine. Feel your hamstrings stretching. Feel your back stretching. Okay. Now, inhale as you come back. Lift your right knee and then lift your left knee as well. Now hold your right ankle, pull it under your left bottom. Okay, so your right knee should face front. Now lift your left leg, take it over your right thigh. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to have a gap between your knee and your chest just going to lock your fingers place them on your knee on the outside inhale lengthen your spine as you exhale pull your tummy in and turn towards your left again hold that position inhale as you exhale pull your tummy in and turn some more Turn your belly. Don't worry about your shoulders. It is your, your navel chakra that we are working. Yeah? The Manipura. So turn it. Now, take your right arm. Lift it up. Hug your knee with your elbow. Hold your right elbow with your palm. Lengthen your spine. And again, turn. Turn as you exhale. Don't worry about your shoulders. Keep the focus on your navel, on your belly. Now you can lock your fingers and you can hold your thigh with your left arm and actively push your body to the side. So basically, your uh, left knee, it'll, it'll be in line with your right armpit. So your whole body has turned now. Hold this position. This is a very nice relaxing position. You're just contracting all the muscles, hugging yourself. Lengthen your spine though, don't hunch your back. Now you can place your left palm on the floor behind you. Lengthen your spine as you inhale. And as you exhale, push your chest back. Don't worry about your shoulders, push your chest back. And then you can just look to the corner. Don't, don't have to turn your head too much because you don't want to strain your neck. Hold this position. Lengthening your spine all the time. Hold it there. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Inhale as you bring your left arm around your leg and straighten your body to face front. Exhale as you lift your leg, do it with your hand, don't force it and straighten your left leg a little, then straighten your right leg, again hold the ankle of your left, pull it under your right bottom, make sure you are sitting on your heel because there should be no gap between your bottom and the floor, so that is why you place your heel under you, again hold your ankle of your right lift it and take it across because i don't want you to strain yourself and try and do it uh, without that support okay again make sure your knee your left knee is facing front keep a gap between your chest and your knee lengthen your spine lock your fingers hold your knee inhale and as you exhale bring your attention to your manipura your navel chakra okay don't worry about your shoulders or your uh, chest or anything at this point you have to turn from the navel. So inhale, lengthen your spine. As you exhale, pull your belly in and turn your body. Hold it there. Again, inhale, lengthen your spine. As you exhale, pull your belly in and turn your body. Now lift your left arm, hug your knee with your elbow. Okay, lengthen your spine, hold your elbow with your right arm, inhale, as you exhale, actively turn your navel again, you can push yourself hold from your leg, so use your leg as leverage, pushing your navel, don't worry about your shoulders or your chest at this point, it's your navel, so you have to turn from the base of your belly, hold it there. Lengthen your spine. Now, place your right palm behind you. Again, lengthening your spine. Push your chest back. No, don't worry about your shoulders. Bring your attention to your Anahata Chakra, your chest. And then just look to the corner, turning your head, the Vishuddha Chakra. You're, you're activating your throat chakra as well. But you don't want to strain it. Just look to the corner, lengthening your spine, holding your belly. And I'm going to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale as you bring your right arm around your leg and turn your body slowly. Exhale. Straighten your leg and straighten the other leg back to Dandasana just for a gentle stretch. Lift yourself, sit on your sit bone, flex your feet, place your palms next to you, facing front, next to your hip. Inhale as you lengthen your spine and straighten your arms. And that's all you need to do. You don't have to lift yourself. Just lengthening your muscles. Gently. Hold it there. And relax. Hold your knees. Pull them in. Cross. Cross them. Hug. And just sit for a few seconds. 